assalamu alaikum my dear brothers and sisters yes sir on the demand of uh, my many subscribers sir make two mark questions important questions in hap organic chemistry sir please sir we want this two mark see on your demand my dear subscribers sir, i am in front of you to discuss about two marks of very important questions and answer in hap see by practicing only these two marks questions in hap one definitely you will get a more than 15 marks see 10 into 2 into 10 20 marks here by practicing only these selected 25 to 24 questions so inshallah you will get more than 15 marks 1 5 marks only in 2 marks so please give your more concentration in this and also for your necessityness means for your easiness what i have done means i have framed a question with answer are you satisfied with this Inshallah, my dear brothers and sisters, let's uh, start that video. First one is a uh, two mark question and answer. The first question: Write the transportation mechanism. You have to write your transportation mechanism. What is that transportation mechanism? Means uh, the transportation mechanism involved through the cell membrane. See, some transportation mechanism are there in our uh, biological system like passive transport, facilitated transport, and active transport. Just to write this three transport, you will get two marks. Yeah. Next question. Write the functions of cell. See, they provide a structure for the body, take in nutrients from body, convert those nutrients into energy and carry out the specialized functions. You remember general functions. Okay. They help to synthesize the food. Then they convert the nutrients into energy and many other functions. Okay. You can also write uh, these uh, cell also helps to protection from the pathogens, from the bacteria. These all functions you can add next what is anatomical uh, position of the body write your significance see the erect position the erect position of the body with the face directed forward 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 okay front the arms at the side the palms of the hands facing back forward forward these are the uh, position of the human body anatomy then significant standard anatomical position provides a clear uh, consistent way of describing human anatomy and physiology means it helps to uh, clear what clear anatomical position it clears the and way of describing human body clear now the next one is write the functions of uh, bones of the skeleton functions of bones of skeleton it gives the body its shape allows movement makes uh, blood cells uh, provides protection for organs and uh, uh, stores uh, minerals clear these are the two mark, uh, four, fourth question or fifth question define erythropoiesis and cardiac output uh, see the formation of rbc in the blood forming tissue means the formation of red blood cell is known as erythropoiesis cardiac output means uh, it is the product of a heart rate into the stroke volume it is known as cardiac output then sixth one name the organs involved in lymphatic system bone marrow spleen thymus lymph nodes and lymphatic vessels these are the organs involved there clear then write the functions of mitochondria yes absolutely you will know the production of atp calcium homeostasis regulation of initiate immunity programmed cell death stem means programmed cell death means uh, your uh, apoptosis apoptosis means uh, this also if apoptosis occur means the mitochondrial functions uh, get diminished means at some condition this mitochondria will prevent from the apoptosis or programmed cell death stem cell regulation these are the mitochondrial functions clear and see here uh, some mistakes are there mistake means spelling mistake why because while typing no due to the automatic um, sensor in my phone smartphone with the smartphone i am typing not with the laptop or the computer so due to that automation or automatic uh, computer sensor what happens no sometimes the letters uh, get missed and they type a wrong one so cooperate with that next one uh, right two difference between arteries and veins very simple arteries carry away the uh, away blood from the heart see the carries mainly oxygenate blood veins opposite they carries uh, bloods means veins are the blood vessels in the human most other animals means they carry uh, blood towards the heart means closeness towards the heart and they mainly carries the deoxygenated blood mention the bones of the lower limb lower limb lower limb downwards Fumor, patella, tibia, fibula, seven tarsal bones and five metatarsal bones and fourteen phalanges. These are the uh, lower bones of the lower limb. Then define anemia and leukemia. 
See anemia, leukemia. By the way, there are these are the rhymes. Anemia means lack of RBC. Leukemia means these are the cancer providing. Is a cancer which involves the unchecked cell death, cell growth. Sorry, cell growth, unchecked cell growth. Okay, persistently growth of the uh, destroyed cell, destroyed cell, or the metabolic decreased cell. Then define active and passive transport. Active transport molecules means they transport the molecules from the region of lower to the higher concentration with the help of the ATP. In the same way, opposite to that is a passive transport. Uh, transport the higher molecules to the lower molecules without any energy, without without utilization of the energy. Both are very important in the biological system. Then define myocardial infraction and hypertension. High blood pressure, also known as hypertension, is a blood pressure that is higher than the normal. Means, uh, what is the normal BP? 120 bar 80. 120 bar 80. Systolic diastolic pressure. If it exceeds, means it leads to high blood pressure. That is BP. Then what is myocardial infraction? A heart attack happens when one or more areas of the heart muscle don't get uh, enough oxygen enough oxygen if the one or more areas of the heart like uh, left atrium right atrium if it won't get the enough blood oxygenated blood then what happens uh, it gets uh, arrested heart attack 13 what is synaptic cleft very important it is asked many times in your previous year examinations state its function synaptic cleft is a space that separates uh, two neurons Okay, the main function of this cleft is to provide a space for the chemical transmission of the messages from the nervous system. Main is to transmit the chemicals, transmit the messages. Then what are rods and cones? Rods and cones, see these are the photoreceptors. First one, cones are the type of photoreceptors in the retina. They give us our color vision, means color. Rods are the type of photoreceptor in the retina. They are sensitive to light uh, level and help us to good vision in the low light okay if dim light low light in the light night time these rods play a vital role in the daytime cones name different cell junction occluding junctions anchoring junctions and communicating junctions these are the three junctions then mention the bones of vertical vertebral column cervical spine thorax spine then lumbar sacral and the tailbone what is neuromuscular junction? The neuromuscular junction, NMG, okay, is the synaptic connection between the terminal end of the motor nerve and the muscle. Muscle means cardiac muscle, skeletal muscle. Okay. Then write the function of a nucleus. The nucleus controls and regulates the activities of the cell, means cell growth and cell metabolism, and carries the genes structure that contain the hereditary information, mainly the synthesis of the DNA or a transfer of the genetic materials. Uh, Okay, these all depends where on the nucleus only. Yeah, 19, write the functions of the skin. Very important. See, this question also asked for 5 marks many times. Don't leave this question. Just practice this question. And here also it many times asked for 2 marks. Provides a protection barrier. Then prevents a loss of moisture. Reduces harmful effects of UV light. UV radiation. Act as a sensory organ. Then also help to regulate the temperature. 20 question, what are the composition of the limb? Yes, a limp is the intestinal fluid. Okay, it consists of the less calcium, few blood proteins, blood proteins, less phosphorus and high glucose concentration. Okay, you can write uh, calcium, blood proteins, uh, you can write phosphorus and glucose. What are the function of spleen? A spleen plays a uh, multiple supporting roles in the body. It acts as a, means it helps, it acts as a fulfillment for the blood as a part of the immune system means helps to filtrate the blood okay and old rbc are recycled then the spleen and the plate set five blood cells are stored here means all composition of the blood maximum stored in the spleen then uh, it helps to mainly collect the destroyed type of the composition of the blood the name before cranial nerves with the function see they are asked for here but uh, for your easiness i have mentioned all the cranial nerves Olfactory nerve, the function of that is sense of smell, optic, ability to vision, see, ocular nerve, move and blind, trocular nerve, ability to move your eyes up and down and back and forth, trigeminal nerve, sensation in your face and cheeks, then jaw movement, some nerve example I have given here, okay, sorry, not all, then angina pectoris and HCHF, angina pectoris, see, it is the chest pain, caused by the reduced blood flow to the heart, now see, CHF, it is the 
कॉन्जेक्टिव हार्ट फेल्यूअर हाँ इज अ क्रोनिक प्रोग्रेसिव कंडीशन दैट अफेक्ट्स द पंपिंग पावर ऑफ यूअर हार्ट मजल सी इट रेड्यूज द पंपिंग पावर लब डब इट रेड्यूज दैट ओके ड्यू टू सम मेनी कॉम्प्लिकेशन मेनी रिस्क फैक्टर्स मेनी कॉजेस दैट वी आर नॉट डिस्कसिंग या बट दिस इज द कॉन्जेक्टिव हार्ट फेल्यूअर ओके मेनली अफेक्ट्स द पंपिंग नेचर ऑफ द हार्ट Yes, my dear brothers and sisters, these are the very very important questions in your pharmacy. Sorry, in your HCP one, two mark questions with answers. Just practice these. Uh, it's enough for your examination. Thank you. Assalamualaikum.